hello there in this video I wanna show how we can create a custom widget area and show the contents of this widget area above the content so as you can see I have uh, represented the content by these uh, squiggly lines so the objective is to show the contents of a widget area above these uh, below the post info uh, rather than just giving the code, I just want to show you how I go about this so you can understand and do this later on when the requirement is slightly different. Alright, so the first step is to install a plugin called Genesis Visual Hooks that will uh, easily provide uh, a list of hooks and show them in place so that you can get the exact hook name that you could use to hook into. So the first thing that I'm going to do is to create a widget area. I'm just going to copy the existing code in the functions PHP and instead of after entry I just want this to be before. So before entry, before entry, before entry. And by the way in this example I'm using magazine pro genesis child theme but the procedure is the same regardless of which child theme you are using. Alright, so I've, I've saved the file so I have registered a custom widget area. Now if I go to appearance and widgets and reload the page so now I have a new widget area or sidebar called before entry into which I can drag my desired content so I'm just gonna drag a widget that I already should be having uh, that's okay. so I have just populated the sidebar with a widget and now I, we just need to display uh, this widget over here and because I already have the Genesis Visual Hooks plugin installed I see a new menu item called G Hook Guide in the WordPress toolbar under that I go to Action Hooks in a new tab and this displays the name of the hooks uh, where we can add uh, our custom content and the hook that I am or the location that I am interested in is this genesis underscore entry underscore content so this hook starts from here and goes below this so I am just gonna copy that go back to my functions PHP and add a action add action paste the name of the hook and give the name of a custom function so I just call this sk before entry alright and then below that I added in I'm, I'm gonna define my function custom function so in this function we need to display uh, the contents of this before entry uh, widget area again I'm gonna scroll up and this particular themes functions PHP happens to ha already have um, the required code for that now uh, here is where we can define the scope as to where this function should be executed uh, so in this particular case let's say I want this to work only on single posts so I can do something like if um, is singular post and then I can just put uh, my content within this function uh, but even better <coughs> what we could do is we can say if it is not a single post then you know go away then you return uh, 
okay so these two li lines of code uh, will simply indicate or tell the function to execute only on single posts and here I need to give the name of the ID or sorry give the ID of the widget area that I would like to be displayed and this would be uh, before okay I've saved that and if I go and reload my page it's not there but when we scroll down uh, we can see that it is below the existing content but we want it to sh be shown above the content above the post content so what we could do is we could lower the priority from the default 10 to say 9 so what this does is that it um, because it has a lower priority uh, the the function uh, will be shown before so that means the contents will be instead of showing up here will end up coming here uh, the way that I remember this is that uh, when things become lower you know they become light so and light things float right they go to the top so when you want some uh, content area or a custom content to be above where it is right now when you use this uh, actions and hooks then you just give the lower priority so when you give it a lower priority it becomes light and it just floats to the top and on the other end if you want something to go below where it is just give it a higher priority okay, and now when I reload the page okay so it is where uh, we want it now it's just a matter of giving some uh, bottom margin so uh, it doesn't kind of appear stuck to the actual content so I'm gonna inspect this alright so each paragraph has a bottom margin of 2.6 rem so for the custom uh, div that we just injected using this add action that is for the before entry div I can use the same bottom margin of 2.6 rem or 26 pixels So let me reload the page and it goes to the top. So this is the way that we typically uh, use uh, hooks in Genesis to position our custom content wherever we want. <clears throat> Hope you found this uh, video helpful. Bye.